Hello everybody, just wanted to make a really quick video to show something that's incredibly useful for anyone that does 3D printing. And that's how to change the infill at different points in the print. So this is the thing hand model from Wednesday, modeled by Hex3D, link in the description, amazing Patreon. Anyway, so this model is printing upside down. It wants to stand on the fingers. However, if you just print it like this, it's gonna fall straight over. So what you wanna do to adjust the infill is you click, you create a, what they call support blocker. Yes, select it, click on your per model settings. And then you wanna go over to modify settings for overlaps. And you're gonna to want to change the infill. So let's search, oops, sorry, my microphone is currently blocking my keyboard. Infill density. And so you want the fingers to be really dense. So let's put the infill density up to say 40%. And then you're gonna select your model, the um, mesh, and just scale it nicely to cover the entire section that you want to modify. So for this, it's nice and simple because I just want to have it as probably like the first joints there. There we go. And if we do a quick slice on there, and if you then hop over into the preview tab, you can see nice dense fingers and then it suddenly drops off. For why, for my purposes, that's probably a bit too little. So let's up that a bit, make the fingers nice and solid. There we go, let's do it there. And then a quick re-slice. And boom, just like that. 10%, 10%, 10% and then nice and thick. So this is not gonna be falling over anytime soon. Probably might find that useful. Bye.